The security camera video is silent, but the real sound and fury was powerful enough to convince officials to evacuate that annex building. Tonight, NBC 15's Darwin Singleton shares what some saw and heard and even felt when the underground explosion rocked downtown. One second, it's a tranquil Wednesday morning in downtown Mobile, and the next, bam! Ron Reams was working in the Government Plaza Annex building when an underground electric transformer buried next to the building exploded. Exploded with enough force to pry open its concrete enclosure. That's what it was, but he didn't know that. You know what it sounds like when a sonic boom goes off? Uh -huh. That's exactly what it sounded like, but it was on the ground. We thought some trucker who didn't know how to read signs went down the bankhead tunnel. So far it doesn't appear there's been any permanent damage, but one thing's for sure, it was an attention getter from several vantage points. The guys working on the side of the Hampton Inn say they heard it too. And two travelers from Pensacola on their way to catch a flight at Brooklyn say they didn't just hear it, they saw it and even felt it. Oh, as we came out of the tunnel, we were stopped in traffic and we heard a loud noise, felt some heat, and there was a big orange fireball coming out of the ground. First, you hear the noise and you look over and there you see the big fireball and a manhole cover went flying in the air too. And, you know, you're like, oh, something <laughs> just exploded. <laughs> no one was hurt, no public property damage, but the transformer explosion did make a lasting impression. Kind of. What, what happened next? I don't know, then traffic just went and we went and yeah. grabbed coffee. <laughs> <laughs> In downtown Mobile, Darwin Singleton, NBC 15 News.